Hey guys, I'm Daniel Ford. Sean Tui. And we're Writer's Bone. We're introducing our new podcast from J.J. Foley's in downtown Boston. For those of you looking for the venereal disease, Writer's Bone, sadly, you will not get your answers here. However, Sean, tell the folks what we will be talking about on this podcast. Well, we will be speaking about pop culture, writing, authors, politics, current events, and anything we think funny. I'm going to say this right now, guys, that Winner's Bone is a movie, but Writer's Bone is going to be one of, one of the funniest podcasts that's coming out this year. The funniest podcast. No. Why? No. We can't do that. I saw it on your face. Why, why can't we do that? No. You're raising expectations on a level we can't possibly meet. Yes, we can. No. No. If we're the 25th funniest podcast on iTunes, then we're overachieving by about 50 points. You want us to be Uganda. <laughs> you want us to be Uganda. Hey, I want us to be huge, but I know, I mean, we're writers. Like, it would, there's a certain amount of, yeah, like, self-deprecation. We that don't to need to be an African nation. No, but, you know, we at least need to be... Do I look black to you? I'm on no, a winning you team. No, but you do look a little bit Hispanic. Like, right around the eyes yeah. a little bit? Yeah. A little bit? Yeah. I Is mean, there something in your past that makes you uh, seem that way? Uh, my Boy Scout leader was a Mexican. Well, that explains so much. It does. It does. Also explains why I have a pair of closets and a Pintos. <laughs> oh, Pintos. Underrated car. It was, yeah. It was, it was, it was, really, it's up there is the DeLorean and the Tucker. The Tucker? I've never heard of the Tucker. That's what what is, is the Tucker? The Tucker was an actual car that came out in the 50s, and it was uh, like the safest car on the road at the time. And it got ran out of business. Tucker reminds me of George Carlin when he does his bit on uh, it suck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fuck Tucker. Tucker sucks. <laughs> so all you Tuckers out there, don't fuck suck. yourself. I think our bartender's name Tucker. <laughs> Besides that, guys, Writer's Phone is going to be a new podcast. It's going to be funny. It's going to be involving us two here every week talking and having a good time. Also, if you can't wait for the podcast, you can follow us right now on Twitter at Writer's Phone. Come on to us at uh, Facebook. I mean, come on to us. Yeah, we please like, come on. Like private yes. uh, Our girlfriends don't mind at all. No, no. no. it's fine. It's fine. Oh, I won't mind. If you want to mail us stuff, that's cool too. Yeah, we'll send you an address. Uh, yeah, DM us on Facebook or yeah, Twitter. Yeah, yeah, no big deal. Yeah, DM us all the time. Give us all the size of DMs. And then, <laughs> also, if that's not enough, you can. We have our blog as well, which is writersbone.blogspot.com. Our YouTube channel, which you're probably watching right now. And if you have anything else, again, just send us a private message. But, back to our original point, we are not Uganda. No. We're going to be really We're funny. not in Uganda. No. We're going to no. be really funny. We're about 75 shades lighter than Uganda. Yeah. And less genocide. Yeah. Is there genocide in Uganda? I'm there sure. was. There yeah, was one point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. Africa. Yeah. They yeah. have a history of it. Yeah. By the way, uh, our black listeners, there's about seven right now. I like how you can see this a black listener. I couldn't even get my Hispanic mother to listen to this. By the way, when my mother listens to this, she will disown me, I think, immediately. Really? Yes. My She'll see that. the name Winner's Bone and be like, you're running a porn site. And uh, actually, they're, they're going to be like, well, it, what took you so long? Yeah, I mean, my, my family thought I was doing porn for a while. See, not only that, but like, wouldn't we make more money doing porn than writing? I think so. I mean, not now. I'm 30 and I'm out of shape and I'm like... Flabby and probably not that good in bed anymore. But I mean, I'm, back I'm, in the day when I was like 18 years old, yeah. I should have totally done it. Really? I yeah. Mean, yeah. I mean, I could try it now. I mean, I'm 26 out of the body of a 45 year old man. Um, I'm awful in bed. And then 18, I had the body of a 42 year old man. Let's just say the over under on us having girlfriends by the end of this is about two weeks. Um, I don't take the under. I'm taking.